Hi, I really like Emacs, and now that I understand buffers and windows, I like to use them a lot. So you can see over here, I've got a lot of them open, and if I go to the bottom here, I've got 48 open, so that's plenty. And that's just the start of it. I'll open a lot more. So for this whole time, I managed it totally fine. Just, you know, switch buffer, or I do switch buffer, and that's been really great. But now it's unmanageable. It's, it's like so unmanageable, I got upset about it, and like it makes me mad so I want to do something about it. I started looking around and there's a few different different solutions um, one of them is like kind of like Eclipse where you have project workspaces but I don't want that because I'm not going to work on different projects and then there's there's an idea that like you should have different frames um, for like different stuff you're working on. I don't want to do that either because that's not really like Emacs stuff so I went and Google it and I looked for stuff out there and then I found this package called Eyebrows and it's really great and I used it and I'm really happy with it. What happened though is like, you know, it's like hard. I can't remember all the bindings and you know, I know like a real Emacs person would remember them and have the muscle memory, but I don't know. I just like, I can't remember them. So what I did over here is I wrote down like all the functions and, and you can see the prefix to do it. Um, I think what that is though when you write it down like that and well number one it shows it's really important and then number two it shows that it's like kind of a literate programming smell like maybe you should do something about it so what I want to do here is like all my system is on you know OS 10 and it's a GUI and like I use the mouse and, and use GUI for everything um, so it like it's easier it helps you remember stuff so I want to do the same thing for eyebrows I want to make a GUI for it like just the simplest way possible so the way I did that is you can see it over here well first an example um, of like how um, different workspaces are so I'm in the I'm in the easy one that is you know just one file and then here's another one where I got a bunch of stuff in it so this is an example of how eyebrows works so I'm gonna go back over here to this one the one I was in and like you can see a little bit how eyebrows works down on the right hand corner it shows you what workspace you're in although there's another word for it so I'm going to go into the code block here and I already set up a hydra for this so that's how I'm going to build the UI okay there we go so I'll put it right there and I'll evaluate that and then I'll run that and you can see it's a simple little hydra but it's really neat because you can go back and forth between them and it's just like using the commands but they're bound to like the the arrow keys like you might recognize from a video game or something the really nice thing it lists the slot number and you can see the code for that you just put some lisp in there um, and then it shows you the current slot and then like closing stuff and and renaming them is all right there too so that's how i developed a ui for managing um, buffers and i want to share that with you if you have any questions, comments, or you want to see anything else, let me know. Thanks and have a great day.